Hi gang, Diana here today. Welcome to the studio. I'm sitting down to do a little art journaling. I'm feeling a little bit overwhelmed with life right now and deadlines, so I think the best thing to do sometimes is just pull back and do something that just relaxes you. And I like to art journal to help me to focus. I have here just some pieces of a magazine called Flow that I've been through a couple of times and now I am uh, pulling apart for collage fodder. Something about a second life there. There's um, some inspiration, some things I'm going to use for collage and some just for inspiration. And um, especially that piece. I loved that piece. And I wasn't sure why this stuff was speaking to me. I just grabbed it because it inspired me. I have three Distress inks there. I believe I have uh, the Pomegranate, Amber, and uh, Chipped Sapphire. I'll check and list below for sure. And I my camera wasn't turned on, but I just ran those Distress inks across the page after, after drawing that little stylized face of mine. And uh, I kept the sketch easy and fast. I didn't have a whole lot of time, but I wanted to make something happen. So you can see I'm just pulling the stripes right across the page there. And I'm um, using a, um, uh, what's it called? I'll get back to that. It's a nice journal, and but it's still pilling a little bit uh, between the sponge and the wetness, I think. It's a still in a burn journal, sorry about that. And I'm just drawing some of that wash now into, into the face and hair. I'm having a little bit of trouble leaving it white and black like that. Um, but I'm trying to not get too into the art details here. I'd like this to be more about just taking the time to relax and not being a complete, just a work of art. I'm trying to take the focus off of that kind of thing. I really love that flowered paper. Um, I just found it very peaceful. And I'm tracing, I've got a piece of it, I'm tracing one edge to follow the contour of my face and so it looks as if that paper is in the background. I'm just working on the other side of my head now and again I trace that that uh, contour and I'm just fitting that in onto that side then I'll just uh, hit it with some glue and uh, go ahead and place that down. So you can see how that looks now, like I'm, my face is up against that lovely background paper, and i um, putting this little sign or piece of collage paper that says Second Life. really do feel that way lately, uh, being pain-free, and uh, for the first time in a year. I might have been overdoing things a little bit, but that's okay. There it goes. Uh, might be a, this video might be a little jumpy. I've had a lot of trouble uh, editing, and I'm hoping it comes out okay. Uh, there's no real way of knowing until I get it up on YouTube, but if uh, I'll just leave it up there anyway because it's it's I think it's worth seeing. I'm not going to try to reshoot the video. And I am pushing that uh, collage piece into the gutter of the book so that it doesn't shift and tear. As I'm working on this, I'm really feeling like it really is speaking to me. I mean, this this bird image in a box that has been opened 
it just feels so right. And I, I'm so glad that I took this, this few minutes, really. Um, it was a little time today, but I really feel like I needed to spend some time here on myself and thinking, um, pulling back from the deadlines. And I mean, they're not going anywhere, but it's sometimes just so necessary to take, whether it's after work, or before work, or even, you know, you get a lunch hour during work. Um, you know, I am lucky in that I can work later tonight in order to enjoy this time that I have here now. Um, so I feel like I want to write a little bit here, and I usually keep my writing private. Another thing I do a lot when I'm writing is to um, turn the book upside down so that if someone does like to look at your book or you like to share your your pages, then that's a, then then they're not going to be able to read it if it's something personal. Or you could just not share your pages. Now, is this face is bothering me because there's not any color there, but you know what? I'm going to let it go. I'm not going to worry about it because this was supposed to be cathartic. It's not supposed to be art. It was supposed to focus me and center me, and it did. Um, so I added a little bit of a border here, and I, I'm out of time, basically, at this point. So I will be saying goodbye. Now check up there on the screen, and you'll see some a couple of videos and um, a picture of me and if you click on either of the videos you, you there there are links to other videos that you might enjoy and if you click on the picture of me you will uh, go to the subs to my home page where there's also by the way a donate to keep this blog going or this YouTube channel going and in that regard there's also affiliate links below and if you want any of the supplies I used today, um, feel free to use those links. I get a small percentage. And all of this is set up so that I can continue bringing you good content and hopefully better content all the time. With your um, comments, I can judge what kind of content you really like the best. And if you hit the like button, um, then I know that, that you're enjoying the content. If you hit the don't like button, which I almost, I don't think I have very many of those, but if you do, let me know why. Do you prefer another type of video? Are my videos too short, too long? Let me know. I am always up for your feedback. So I hope I will see you very soon. Have a great day. Diana out. <laughs> Bye, folks.